Hello everybody, how's it going? This is Silent here with Mass Effect. I'm Dickie B. I'm Greg. <laughs> Greg. Greg. And what the hell? What the fuck? What? 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 Ranks. We're in an what? elevator. <laughs> what is he wearing? What the fuck, Rex? I love how I just uploaded like part twenty-six, and you guys are still freaking out over the armor like ten episodes later. <laughs> I mean, you know, just, I forgot about it. <laughs> okay, so after the Benezia fight, there's still some shit on the uh, on Novari that I didn't do. I almost called it the Citadel. What the hell is wrong with me? This one you almost a cut up. That you could ease. I didn't. I didn't do any of these side missions. It would compensate. Oh yeah, these guys are annoying. This one <laughs> it took me forever to beat Benezia, so I was just like, <laughs> I'm, I'm out of here. I'm leaving right now. It only took me a couple tries. Yeah. You want me to use my I had to get. I had to get silent to help. <laughs> really? It's terrible, dude. Yep. Yeah. I have no problem. Uh, it is. It, I'm awful. This in this episode, we experience the glorious the act of smuggling. To your this All badass jellyfish wants you to smuggle some one. packages. Oh god! I just oh. this one might cocaine, meth, crystal meth, maybe. Get it. Maybe a hey. new outfit for Rex. Who knows? <laughs> but I just kind of sped through everything. Because Shepard runs about as slow as a kid in a wheelchair looks, through a fucking field of molasses. He looks like he's got to stick up his butt. <laughs> what did you say that one time? It was like that run animation makes it look like they're trying to like cup a uh, cupcake in between their butt cheeks or something. Dude, dude, I love the way he's running so fast up his. <laughs> oh, you're not doing it. Looks like he's very delicately like trying to hold something in between his butt. No, it just looks like he's like trying trying to hold an egg in between his butt and like waddle. That's probably a competition in, in this time frame, Greg. Like you know, potato sack races and <laughs> we got like the three-legged races now. But in 2083, they're gonna have egg butt races or whatever. What if you got in one of those like three-legged races, but with a Hanar, so there's like eight tentacles or whatever? You lose. They'd probably just fall over, and you'd have to drag them. They'd probably like, yeah, you'd, you'd like throw it over your shoulder. This one would never. Let's go. <laughs> I got a jellyfish backpack. <laughs> question, Greg. What's your question? What class did you pick? I picked I picked Vanguard because I want to do it easy, but I'm gonna go back and probably do like. Adapter infiltrator. For some reason, every time I play this, this game, I always pick soldier. To Soldiers to I'm, me, soldier to me is really boring. I'm just browsing right now. I was gonna, but like, I, I want to use like a lot of biotics and stuff. I'm like, I want too, to I'm try too it out. To use anything else? Now back to the actual main missions. We're going to After Vermeer. Smuggling. Vermeer. Spoiler. Trying to decide who to pick here, because I've went through everybody, but I usually just go with uh, Rex and Garrus because they're my two favorites of this game. Check out those defense towers. You're two homeboys, pretty much. Yeah. Guess what we gotta do? Oh, all right. This is another part that took me forever. Oh, okay, well, Kitty. If you, I'm not letting you out. That <laughs> up against me if you don't want me picking you up. And petting you. So, we got uh, another Mako driving mission. This actually did... I, I mean, this one is kind of stupid sometimes, because if you die by any chance, you have to start all the way back unless you save frequently. From the beginning. From the beginning. And that's something, something I learned from uh, a wise man told me that I should save a lot. Who was that? And uh, that, w that might have been you. I thought it was Mr. Miyagi, honestly. Oh, it could have been Mr. Miyagi. I just had a horrible thought. There's gonna be Mass Effect anime, right? Thirty is. Oh, that yeah. Is. Imagine. I wonder if they go to this planet. I wonder if they're gonna have the uh, overly cliche, sexy beach episode. <laughs> <laughs> you just uh, see like play. Ashley Williams and Benezia in bikinis and like Commander Shepard's the Baywatch kind of guy. <laughs> Uh, Garrus is in a he's in a banana hammock. Garrus oh. is in a one piece swimsuit. On what? Ew. 
Got like, just, got like Caden I, doing some poses. Just imagine him just wearing normal swim trunks, though. So. I don't know, man. Oh. They go skinny dipping. Whatever. <laughs> and Rex, what's up? Fan service. Oh, God. Oh, I don't... Uh, honestly, oh. I've watched about like five minutes of that anime movie thing, Paragon Lost, with James Vega's main character. Yeah. It was just so fucking weird to me to see animated Mass Effect. Like that's something I never thought I would see. It, I mean, it's... it was just weird to me. I had to turn it off because like this is fucking weird, man. I can't do this. Wait, James Vega, he's the guy in the he's... third game, the fucking he... meathead I hate guy. Him. Fuck him. <laughs> Goddamn Jersey douchebag. <laughs> This was the part I died at. I died at this part seven times because I didn't know I could jump until I was on that snowy planet. How did you not know you could jump? I don't know. I just I just didn't know I could jump. To be oh. fair, I completely forgot I could jump too. How yeah, do you see, dodge stuff then, guys? Seriously, I, I, uh, we don't. I just drove around, and I didn't know I didn't know I had missiles either. I just I was just shooting everything. Oh. And then you told me, you're like, yo, why don't you use a missile? And I was like, what? <laughs> what is that? What is this <laughs> dumbfounded what technology? Crazy language you're speaking. Look, your head glitch in that rock. Uh, protein. Called... <laughs> head what? glitching with a giant tank, yes. Yeah. A giant it's called... rover. I believe it's called a Mako. It's the, the type of vehicle. What do you call it, a Mako or a Mako? It's Mako. I've heard people call it Mako. Then they're stupid. I, they are stupid. Don't get me wrong. Macaroni. So Just sometimes, like sometimes you have to get out and actually um, kill some enemies, get the gates, whatnot. I died to these parts too. Just checking for enemies. I'm getting shot. I, I don't know who's shooting or if I'm being shot at. <laughs> I kind of lost Rex. track. He's just making sure that wall's dead. This shit sucks. Mine's a lot easier. Yeah, I know. This is the PC one. Fun times. What's it called? Every time, like, sometimes I would do that, it'd say, like, my decryption skill is too low. Like, how do you... How does one... There's a stat for that. Yeah, you gotta Let's... check it when leveling up. There's literally a decryption stat. Fuck. <sighs> Fucking peaches. Honestly, don't. I thought that having Garrus on your party fixed that. I might. That's how little. I um, it depends if you level his description stat or if you have technical skills yourself. Oh, fuck. No, I just allow my people to level themselves up. Mmm. I mean, that could be good, but it's also kind of bad at the same time. Oh. The way I set yeah, it up I was um. When I did Uncharted Worlds, I had it so that, like, Garrus had the highest decryption he could, and then Tally had, like, highest, um, like, electronics and stuff. So I had both. Mm. So I could get everything I possibly could. Interesting. It's a good, Interesting. good strategy. Do you know, like, I felt really bad about in this game when I was playing it? What? Was it like, I found like, the like two really good teammates. I just never swapped them out. That was all I used. Oh, like it was it. Like I think I used Rex and Yara the whole game. Oh, I gotta say, when I see the crouch animation, I kind of wonder something. I kind of wonder if the purse, if one of the lead people behind this thing had a m thing for men's butts. <laughs> oh God, and. Cut. Go. End scene. Done. Bye. <laughs>